Welcome to Deed Check and Subdivide. With either of these programs, you can easily plot deeds, check areas and closure, check for parcel overlaps, draw up a single deed, several deeds, or even an entire subdivision. Entering deeds is quick and easy, with several methods for you to choose from. With the manual method, the program prompts you step-by-step -step for each bearing, distance, or curve parameter. Lines and curves are plotted immediately so you can see your progress as you work. Or you can enter the deed all at once. Simply enter the deed calls and then plot it out. If you later need to make any changes, you can easily call it back up, make your changes, and then replot it. Have you ever had a deed where you couldn't read one of the deed calls? Just enter a question mark for the missing deed call and the program will attempt to solve it for you. Parcels described by sectional breakdown are easy to enter. There is no need to learn any special codes or abbreviations. Simply type in the description just like it appears in the deed. If you need to plot adjoining parcels, they will be positioned correctly even if they are in separate sections. You can plot out just the single parcel or the entire breakdown of the section. You can also use this dialog to set a section corner and then use it to tie in related deeds. Deed Check can also automatically plot a deed. Simply copy and paste the deed into the automatic deed reader. If any issues are found or if the routine does not understand something, it will flag it over here on the left. Once these issues are addressed, click OK and the deed is plotted out. Once the parcel has been entered, you can review a detailed report of the entire boundary, complete with closure and area. You can then make a printout of the report, copy and paste it into your word processor, and also paste it back into the drawing. For additional detail, you can add your own text, including text along a curve and paragraphs of text. Symbols can be added, including tree symbols, and additional line work can be added to show easements, setbacks, house pads, and more. Over 30 line types are available in various thicknesses and colors. Do you need to check if two lots overlap each other? Just start the command, select each lot, and view the results. Also included is a collection of powerful editing commands that let you move, copy, rotate, trim, extend, and more. With the Layers feature, you can place the various elements of your drawing on separate layers and then show or hide them as needed or quickly change the line type and color for objects on a layer. And if you need to send your work over to another firm, such as an engineer or land surveyor, you can export your drawing to a DXF file, which can be easily loaded into their AutoCAD or GIS system. You can also use this feature to import basic parcel information that they might send you in the same DXF format. And to help you quickly get up to speed, both DCheck and Subdivide include a full set of training videos. The lessons are listed in a convenient outline so you can quickly pick and choose just the ones that you want to watch. Now let's talk about just the Subdivide program. This program is essentially the big brother to DCheck. In addition to everything in Deed Check, it also includes these additional features. Blocks. Subdivide comes with over 40 additional symbols called blocks. What makes them different than the symbols in Deed Check is that you can create your own or even modify the ones that come with the program. Subdivide also contains several features to help you design lots and subdivisions. Use the site calculator to calculate how many lots will fit on a buildable parcel of land. You can also specify how many lots you want, and it will tell you the size that each lot needs to be. The Change Area of a Lot section contains three commands that you can use to resize a parcel to an exact area. For example, if you need a lot to be exactly half an acre in size, these routines can help you get there. There's also a routine that can automatically divide up a parcel into smaller parcels. You can divide the original parcel into X number of equal parts, or you can specify the desired parcel area and have it divided up that way as well. Use the cul-de-sac routine to create cul-de-sacs. 
You can create them at the end of a line or a curve, and you can also create a cul-de-sac where a curve would be. With the Subdivide program, you can take screenshots from Google Earth and import them right into your project. There you can use them as a location map or you can fit the image to your project and use it to trace features into your drawing. And once your project is finished, you can export the lines and curves to a KML file, which can be opened and viewed in Google Earth. To find out more about either of these programs, please visit us at www.dcheck.com or call us at 1-800-548-9223.